Here's the dealio. Let's join KYD and get something like this. No. Inches tall. Show price, 140. This is the Jayco Pinnacle. I think it would do pretty good. No. We did a circle around each other. Tiny arms. I said I liked it. He likes your belly rubbed if you want to rub it. No. So here's the dealio. We're at the Ocala, Florida RV show. It's a little windy today, so we got our jackets on. Makes it a little cool. So I apologize if it's wind's coming through the microphone. Right, we're gonna check this place out, look at some more RVs, kind of give you a little insight of what this uh, Ocala RV show is all about, to see if it's worthwhile coming to. Shall we begin? That you're free? Yeah, I just made it. it says under. Un under 16 inches tall, so you're free. Never seen a rocking chair before outdoors. We're shocked. How is it? <laughs> I hope you don't have me on camera. I do. We just get here. And she finds clothes. Let's join KYD and get something like this. Huh? Oh, yeah. Look all the windows though. There is a lot of room actually in here. Yeah, there is. There really is. Because of that. Mm -hmm. See, here's your desk right there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking we can do it. <laughs> What do you think? Uh, hmm. She didn't say no. And look at that price. Oh my God, she's going into a truck camper. Literally, she's doing this on her own. Are you losing your mind? <laughs> There's actually a lot more room in here than you would think. Hmm. Nice big bed area here. Closet. It's like some storage back in there. You'd have to climb up in there to get into those. A little tiny TV up here. Little fridge. Pretty tiny. But doable. It's old? No. No? Oh. All in one bathroom. Love the interior. It's really pretty. Here we go, our Sprinter van. Show price, 140. What? 2020 you know, uh, American yeah, Coach, pink tree, four by six. <laughs> Think we get on each other's nerves in here? Yeah.
Non. Look at this huge storage. Thanks for your washer and dryer here. This is the Jayco Pinnacle. That's pretty cool. And what model number is this, Michelle? 36 uh, KPTS. KPTS. Again, the Jayco Pinnacle. Very nice oven. Oh, it has a place for an attachment right now. <laughs> nice. Far Will those two slide over, both? Yeah. Nice. Control panel here. Nice coat closet here. You will love the shower. Hey. 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 Where it up? We could both fit in here, honey. Hey. How nice is that? So pass the test. Okay, so that's where the yep. <laughs> pass the test. Yeah. Didn't look 100%, did it? Very nice bedroom. Very huge. King size bed. Nice big closet. Washer dryer hookup. Washer dryer hookup. Just get rid of those shelves right there, and they just fits straight in there. My cedar closet. Oh, nice. All right, what do you think? I'm liking this floor plan. I'm really liking it. Gel coat finish. Back side of the refrigerator, the other side of that big storage.
there's a baby pig. Bad daddy. Thirty six hundred. It's a propane generator. That's what the LP stands for on it. Oh. Not bad storage. Uh huh. How about this one? That's just propane. toy hauler down here and I went through one door Michelle went through the other I went looking times. for her and she was coming through back through that door <laughs> yeah, we did a circle around each other looking for each other <laughs> a couple hamsters in a hamster yes. cage A different one. Place for your washer and dryer. King size bed. Leather feels nice. It does have this table that comes up. Forza's has their table on the side. Nice. Looks like a 50 inch TV, 50 55. I'm getting comfortable. Wow. I guess you are. And <laughs> I don't think so. You gotta pull the food thing out, <laughs> which I don't like that when you have to pull them out. There's a table that goes in there and a little peg goes through that and it gives you a little table, kind of like in the grand designs. So there you go. Now. That is the most awkward contraption I think I've ever seen. Definitely not. User friendly? There is a lot of storage. So I'm guessing there's storage under both. We don't. I won't make you do them both. What we got there? Just storage there. Yeah. Storage. Storage. Mm-hmm. 
Is this a double, double sink? sink. Both sides are the same side. Okay. You got room under the sink for a garbage can. That's my biggest pet peeve. There's not enough room in there, and there is room. Okay. Don't want a garbage can sitting outside. Are they soft clothes? Nope. Gas burner stove. We got a residential fridge. Just a single door res. We got in here, Michelle. Queen size bed. Got double closet space. Look, you. I can have my each own. Each could have our own. And it goes all the way across, oh, all the way through. Yeah, oh, got a nice, nice shot of your hair there. I like how you got a nice size little yeah, uh, in, space on either side. end tables, a washer and dryer. Off the wall. Put it in. I got the sink space and the toilet's right in the road though. What's in front of the sink? The can, man. <laughs> Pretty good storage, really. Goes all the way through on the top and bottom. on the bottom over here. I found your desk. How about you go up this desk? That one? I think you have to be a T-Rex. <laughs> Tiny arms. Now I just love that this back goes up like this and it has a screen that comes down. Can you imagine backing up to a beautiful view, river, <laughs> or that and uh, <laughs> hearing the wind coming from that beautiful view <laughs> Love all the windows with the airstreams. Can you say that again? <laughs> I said I liked it. You like yeah. an airstream? Oh my god. She likes the airstream. Could this be our new home? Could it be uh, our new home? That, that. It ranks up there. Hey, that's a start. That's all I asked for. <laughs> How are you? Do you like and to see my blue jays? Oh. Uh, she I'm says it is. She's my doggy. She your... likes her belly rubbed if you want to rub it. Well, is it going to bite? No, it is. <laughs> I leave you for a second and then you're surrounded by clowns. It's not the Tampa RV show. No, it's no. not as big as that, but it's pretty good size and there's plenty to look at. Yeah, I'd um, agree. I think they had about a little bit of something for everybody. No Tiffins, no Numars. As far as the show goes, it's worth going to. Yeah. I mean, it's uh, it was a little easier to look at RVs than it was at the Tampa RV show because you didn't have quite the mass you right. there. Yeah. I don't know. I'm <laughs> thinking that Airstream might be on the radar. <laughs> Still have to work out a few things. What do we gotta work out? Um, no, we no. did not find our new home yet. As far as the Ocala RV show, yes, we would recommend going. It's worth going to. Yeah. And plus, it's only five dollars. Yeah, can't beat that price. Guess what? See you in the next video. Bye. <laughs> Call it a day.